fam? It has been a minute since we've sat down to talk like this. I want to say the last video I did kind of with a little intro like this was before Japan and Japan was in June, my dudes. It's been a while. It has been a while. As you can see from the title of this video, this video is more of like a small vlog about my time in Florida. I didn't really focus on vlogging. I wanted to just legit chill by the pool all day every day and just relax um because mama needed a vacation like that who did she um i feel like i have so many updates and none all at the same time uh as you can see i have no makeup on i got out the shower and i was like all right cool let's beat this face for this video and i was like actually no i am about to start my period any day now so i went and said veto makeup and i put on my little laneige water sleeping mask on that I really, really like. Um, this is the sample size that comes in that Sephora travel pack thing that they sell for $40. And I'm literally using this like tiny, tiny bits because I don't want, because you know this costs about $92.77 for a pot maybe a little bit bigger and I'm not about to spend that. So we have like a little tiny bit more really um so yeah i did not and my face is like tons of like acne and menstrual acne and stuff like that but honestly it is what it is i didn't want to have to put a whole face of makeup on to then remove it after this video that would just not be worth it um but yeah as you can see japan vlogs are officially done it was quite an interesting trip um as a fat person navigating in japan was wild interesting um as a non-asian person uh a non-asian non-white it was kind of like woo uh my brother has curly hair in an afro that's blue and i'm telling you the amount of stares we got laughed at stares people talking shit and the thing is my brother understands japanese so when people would talk shit he knew what they were saying so it was kind of that was really frustrating i was just like damn not the welcoming party granted there's a lot of history between japan and the u.s so like you know it was just a lot it was just a lot um it might be a while before i go back to japan because of that but other than that it was there was beautiful sightseeing the food was awesome um but yeah it was japan uh florida just passed last week i went for like a week and some change it was awesome to just kick back chillax relax not there for sightseeing just resting by the pool chilling the beach had the red algae uh so no beach for us but other than that it was really relaxing i get to go back in october for family weekend at uh, my brother's college so i'm really excited to just do that and i'm going with my cousin before the year ends desiree we are going to go to florida we're making that trip happen my dog just got up and scared the shit out of me um and then and then coming up in a week I'm going to Vegas again, <laughs> but this time my mom and I will be going with Rudy Dre and Fritz and you have met them before. If you see my 50 shades, Valentine, Galentine, friend time vlog, those were the people that I went with. Um, and all five of us are going to go to Vegas together. And I'm telling you now it's going to be wild. What the fuck happened last night? <sighs> hey, Phil. Am I missing a tooth? I can't. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. My lateral incisors, it's gone. Mm -hmm. Really wild. Like I'm both excited and concerned that it might just be hella crazy. But I can't wait. I'm so excited. We are going to go to a mail review show. <laughs> um check out some of the club scene that we didn't do our first trip gamble more all day every day the buffets <laughs> hit me with that buffet um so i'm just hyped hyped that we're going back to vegas um 
this upcoming week, I'm going back to Cold Spring, but I'm taking my cousin with me. She's never been. Um, I have a get ready with me planned, a little summer review video. This fall, I am treating it kind of like the new year. I feel like summer was really, that retrograde had me all the way up. Um, and it was a lot of, I don't have a better word, not soul searching, but a lot of like looking within myself and doing work on myself in the second half of the summer. And I'm in a place where I'm excited for what is to come and the work that I have to do. Uh, so September to me is kind of like 2019. I know it's not, but it's just like, okay, cool. New year, new me. What content am I putting out? I am just trying to kind of focus my mind, my soul, my energy, and just get back into the groove of things now that all of Japan is done. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel because I see the numbers. So if you're watching and not clicking subscribe, come on. Commit to it. Share. Follow me on Instagram at ACNYC underscore. And I'm just excited for the fall. If you have any video ideas, any kind of content you want to see, please feel free to DM me on Instagram, email me, comment in a vlog video. Um, I'm just really hyped for this next phase. Also, I got to make my own URL for YouTube. And when I tell you I was so gassed, I was a goober. I was in a hotel while I was in Florida. And I was like, oh my God, what should I call it? Oh shit, what do I do? And I did it and I was like, mom, sit next to me, hold my hand, I'm gonna hit click. And I was just so excited. The little things, people. I was so excited. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Enjoy the vlog. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, follow me on Instagram. Until next time, my friends. Deuces! Are you vlogging? <laughs>
It's beautiful. I'm in this comfy ass bed. And I'm happy. And relaxed. Here we go. We just finished our lunch here at Whole Foods. We had a little bit of everything. Sam and I play the Sharesy game where we each get something and split it because it's better. Um, and now we're gonna head back onto our bikes and bike away through the city of Sarasota. <laughs> One hour later. Y'all, we just finished biking from our hotel to my brother's school. I have just spent some time at the library of my brother's school after that bike ride, which was crazy as hell. I haven't biked in so long and the sun was beating down hard. Um, I'm meeting up with him in a bit. Then we're gonna jump back on our bikes check out his new dorms and then head back to the hotel for some dinner. I have to say this is exactly the kind of trip that I needed in my life at this moment because bitch let me tell just inhales, breaths, be at one with oneself. I love this. This guy's about to fucking open up on my ass. <laughs> Y'all are in my basket of my bike. We're about to take a quick little journey and my brother's biking 82 miles an hour leaving me behind let's try this and we are not off now we're off here we go where's my brother at the end huh ah. are we walking the bike now where are you going what are we doing Hold on. <laughs> Bye. So we just took an Uber to our next hotel and it's confusing. There's a hotel in front and one in the back. I'm gonna take it to the one in the back. We get there to the lobby and there's a sign, come into the hotel in the front to check in. Bitch, what? The fuck? Y'all are two separate hotels. What is y'all doing? Ugh. Also the Uber driver was dumb cute. And I'm like, do I pull an insecure moment and like leave him a comment when I give him his ratings and be like, what's good? Shoot my shot. Not going to do it though. Good morning. Buenos dias. Today is Wednesday. Every time I'm on vacation, like I don't keep tab on the days and the time at all, but it is Wednesday. My parents arrived today. But the game plan is to go get free breakfast here at this hotel, lounge in the pool, and relax. I just spent the last five hours in the pool. It was really chill, but I had to leave because my skin started going from like, ooh, sun kiss to, bitch, you barbecuing in this pool right now. Get up out here. And I've been putting sunscreen nonstop. I put sunscreen from super gloop on my face. But I'm feeling like I just roast it. Good morning, beautiful humans. I am on my way to get breakfast at the hotel. It's complimentary, so <laughs> you don't buy that life. I woke up this morning with Mandy Moore. Only hope stuck in my head. You might only So I played the original from Switchfoot. And I'm like, let's play a little TBTs. I am tan, but I'm also burnt. Yeah, today's game plan. We are gonna do all the school shopping for my brother and enjoy, cause today's like the only real like vacation day my parents have, cause tomorrow is moving day. It is red algae season, so the red algae is blooming and killing tons and tons literally i mean tons of fishes here in florida there's actually a state of emergency so there's no beach for us um and when you get close to areas that are by a beach stinks of fish Pero, 
We're live. We're here. We're getting our free breakfast. Goodbye, the Virage Hotel. It's been real. Thanks for the memories. Alrighty, y'all. Good morning. Today is my final day here in Florida. <laughs> this car parked so close to the fucking. St I am so sad to be leaving Florida. I have had such an amazing week. A week of the day, really. I really needed this trip um, to just shut it off. Living in New York, and I'm sure in a big city, can be really overwhelming. And I rep New York hard. I mean, like, born and raised. So, I swear by New York, but I can also admit when it can be overwhelming, it can be chaotic, it can be draining, it could just be really bad for your mental health and just for your soul and spirit. So I think it's important to take breaks from that lifestyle. So it has been great to just like sit in a pool with myself, with my thoughts, relax, ride a bike, like the fuck? I really wanna get a bike back home, but I don't wanna be biking in the streets. So, is this door open? I don't have a key. <sighs> Gotta go to the front of the hotel, god dang it. Um, but yeah, I, I fly out by myself. My parents come hours later. Um, so I'm gonna be on that plane, watching my Netflix to the boys I've loved and trying to write a little bit and get back in my journal so that I can plan and just prepare myself. I wanna take this calm energy back home and just be this serene when I get back to New York and at peace. So I'm sad to leave. Part of me would love to live out here, but then the other part is like, oof, now it's out here. Oh, that sun, bitch. So, yeah, I will be back in October for family weekend, and I'm trying to come again before the year ends with my cousin so we can both enjoy a little weekend trip and hang out with my brother and chill in the pool and stuff like that. All right. Bye.